Hi, my name is Sia, and today I'll be teaching you how to divide fractions. There are three easy steps that you can use to divide fractions, and once you get the hang of it, you can honestly just divide any fractions um, in no time. The three steps are keep, change, and flip. So let's take an example to understand the steps. We have three-fifths divided by two-sevenths. The first step is to keep. So we keep the first fraction in the equation, so we have 3 over 5, we just keep it as it is. So just bring it down to 3 fifths. Change. You have to change the division symbol into a multiplication symbol. And lastly, flip. You have to flip the last fraction, which is 2 over 7, to 7 over 2. This is super easy because all you have to do is just keep the first fraction, change the symbol, and flip the last fraction. So it goes to 3 fifths times 7 over 2. And finally, just solve the problem so you have 3 fifths times 7 over 2, which is 21 over 10. Multiplying fractions is really, really easy as well because you're just multiplying numerator by numerator and denominator by denominator. So you have 3 times 7 is 21 and 5 times 2 is 10. Let's look at some more examples to understand the concept. So here we have 5 over 2 divided by 4 over 6. Remember, we keep the first, change the symbol, and um, flip the last fraction. So we have 5 over 2 times 6 over 4, which is equal to 36 over 8, and we can simplify that to 9 over 2. Next, we have 2 over 6 divided by 8 over 9, which can be um, changed to 2 over 6 times 9 over 8. Remember, we're keeping the first, changing the symbol, and flipping the last. And so we get 18 over 48, which is uh, which can be simplified to 3 over 8. Here we have 7 over 2 divided by 1 over 7. Um, again, keep, change, flip. So we have 7 over 2 times 7 over 1. And we get 49 over 2. Lastly, we have 9 over 25 divided by 3 over 15. We can do 9 over 25 times 15 over 3 because we keep, change, and flip. And... At the end, we get 135 over 75 is equal to 9 over 5. Thank you for watching.